GitHub Copilot just dropped updates that are absolutely insane. I'm talking AI that reviews your code like it knows your entire project. Agent mode that plans, builds, and executes everything for you. This isn't just an update. This is the future of coding, and it's happening right now. All right, so GitHub Copilot just got some crazy updates. And honestly, if you're still coding the old way, you're wasting hours every single day. I'm going to show you exactly what changed, why this matters, and how you can start using it today to code faster and smarter. But first, let me tell you what's actually happening here because this is bigger than just another AI tool update. So the first massive thing is Copilot code review. This is now in public preview and it works across all programming languages in your pull requests. Think about this for a second. You push code and instead of waiting for your team to review it, Copilot jumps in and reviews everything. But here's where it gets wild. It's not just some basic AI scanning your code. It merges AI power with real tools like CodeQL and the ES Lint. So you're getting AI smarts plus the tried and tested tools developers have trusted for years. And the context this thing has is crazy. Copilot code review can look at your entire project structure, check your directories, understand how files connect to each other. It's not just reading one file, it's understanding your whole architecture. Now, here's the part that blew my mind. When Copilot code review finds issues, it doesn't just tell you what's wrong. It can hand off to the Copilot coding agent to actually fix the problems for you. So you get a review, you see the issues, and then boom, fixes come in through a pull request. This is automation at a whole different level, and you can customize how it reviews your code. You can set up an instructions file or a Copilot instructions file that tells Copilot your team's style, your standards, the tone you want for reviews. So it's not some random AI voice, it's reviewing code the way your team would. Plus this works across Visual Studio code, Visual Studio, JetBrains, and Code. So no matter what editor your team uses, everyone gets the same consistent reviews. So why does this matter? Because cleaner code means fewer review cycles. Fewer review cycles means faster shipping. And when you have AI anchored by real deterministic tools like CodeQL and ESLINT, you can actually trust the feedback. This isn't just hype, this is practical stuff that saves real time. But wait, because the VS Code updates are even crazier. We're talking agent sessions, sub agents, and plan mode. Let me break this down because this is where Copilot goes from being your assistant to being your lead developer. So, so first, agent sessions. You can now manage coding agent sessions right inside Visual Studio Code. These can be local or cloud-based. You've got a whole view dedicated to tracking what your agent is doing. And here's the key thing. You can spawn sub-agents for specific tasks. Say you want one sub-agent focused on test-driven development and another doing research. These sub-agents are isolated from your main chat. That means better token usage, better context, and no confusion between different tasks. Then there's plan mode. This is next level. You can ask Copilot to create and execute step-by-step -step implementation plans. It analyzes your code base, generates an execution plan, validates requirements, and then starts coding. So instead of you figuring out every little step, Copilot is planning the entire feature for you. You're literally telling it what you want and it's figuring out how to build it. And if you're on Visual Studio Code Insiders with Copilot Pro, you can even access OpenAI Codex as an engine. So you're getting the latest and greatest AI models powering your coding workflow. All right, so back to these updates. Let me tell you why this shift from assist me to lead me mode is so huge. Traditionally, you tell an AI what to do. It gives you a suggestion. You implement it, you check it, and you keep going back and forth. That's assist mode. But with agent sessions and plan mode, Copilot is leading, it's managing tasks, orchestrating changes across multiple files and handling high level workflows. You're not micromanaging anymore. You're giving it a goal and watching it work. Here's a real example. You could tell Copilot plan out a new user login flow with OAUTH tests and documentation. Plan mode kicks in, figures out all the steps, and then the agent starts executing. It creates the files, writes the code, adds the tests, and updates the docs. You review it, give feedback, and ship. That's hours of work condensed into minutes. Now let's talk about how you actually get started with this stuff, because I know some of you are already thinking, how do I turn this on right now? For Copilot code review, you need pull requests on GitHub. When you create a pull request, you just choose Copilot as a reviewer. That's it. Copilot will jump in, analyze everything, and drop comments just like a human reviewer would. If you're working in VS Code, you can trigger reviews directly from there too. For the VS Code agent stuff, make sure you have the latest Copilot extension and the latest version of VS Code. 
Now, let me give you some real world impact here because this isn't just about cool features. This is about actual business results. First, code quality goes up. When you have AI reviewing every pull request with full context and deterministic tools, you catch more bugs, you enforce standards, and your code base stays clean. That means fewer production issues, fewer hot fixes, and a more stable product. Second, reviews get faster. Instead of your senior devs spending hours on code reviews, Copilot handles the first pass. Your team only needs to review what Copilot flags or what needs human judgment. That frees up your best people for higher value work. They can focus on architecture, on mentoring, on solving hard problems, not on catching missing semicolons. Third, consistency across the team. When you define your standards in an instructions file, everyone gets reviewed the same way. No more different standards from different reviewers, no more subjective opinions causing friction, just clear, consistent feedback based on your team's rules. And for DevOps teams, this is huge. Faster reviews mean faster merges. Faster merges mean faster deployments. Faster deployments mean you can iterate quicker and respond to customer needs faster. This reduces bottlenecks in your entire pipeline. But here's the thing I need to say, RI is not perfect. You still need to review outputs. Don't blindly merge what Copilot suggests. Always verify, always test. The AI is a tool, not a replacement for your judgment. The docs emphasize responsible use, and you should too. So here's the bottom line. These updates are turning GitHub Copilot from a coding assistant into a full workflow partner. It's reviewing your code with real context. It's planning features for you. It's managing tasks across your entire project. This is the future of development, and it's happening right now. If you're still coding the old way, you're going to get left behind. The teams that adopt this stuff early are going to ship faster, build better products, and outpace everyone else. So try these features today, push a pull request, and add Copilot as a reviewer. Open VS Code, switch to agent mode, and give it a real task. See what happens.